So what we're going to do today is called the McGurk effect, and it's going to basically test what you hear, and you're also going to rely on what you see as well. So just follow the instructions that are on the screen, and I'll help guide you through this. And you're going to be watching a movie with this man, and he's going to be saying some syllables, and your job is to watch and follow the instructions and then report back to me what you hear. So listen carefully, and this is one where his mouth has been covered, so you can't see his lips. Ba ba, ba ba, ba ba. ba so listen several times, ba, and as soon as you're sure what ba, you hear, ba, just report to me what you think ba, he's saying. Ba ba, ba ba, ba ba, ba ba. Okay, good. Ba, ba, so you hear ba ba. Mm -hmm. ba, ba. Now let's do the same thing again, but the sound's been taken out, and you're going to be reading his lips alone. So focus really closely on his lips only, and try to lip read and tell me what you think he's saying. So take your time, but when you think you know what he's saying based on lip reading, let me know. Da da. I think it's da da. Okay. So you hear da da. Ba, ba, now this is with ba, both the sound ba, and ba, you can ba, see his lips at the same time. Ba, 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 ba. It sounds like a weird. Ba, 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 ba. So when I look away. Am I allowed to look away? Yes, you're allowed to look away. When I look away, I hear ba ba. Mm -hmm. ba, ba when ba, I look ba. at him, ba, 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 I hear ba, da da, or it's like a ba, it's a strange ba, da da. Yeah, that's ba, really interesting. Why do you think that is? Actually, let's go back one more. Ba, 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 Why do you think that is? That when you look ba, away, you hear something different than when you look right ba, at it. I think that um, what I'm hear what I'm hearing, if I hear it just in isolation, like if I'm just listening to it, then I'm hearing and I'm, I'm just perceiving things based on hearing. Mm -hmm. But then if I have to look at him, look at the screen, and then hear it as well, then I integrate what I'm hearing with what I'm seeing, and, I, and then I end up hearing something different. Yeah, so it's interesting. It's playing the same sound, but what you're seeing can change your perception of what you hear. So try this trick. Try watching what he's saying and then blinking your eyes in between every couple of seconds and see. Yeah, so then I hear ba da. Oh, that's really interesting. So it's even switching right back and forth really rapidly. So what's really going on here in this video is, uh, I can assure you that in every single frame, mm -hmm. it's playing the exact same audio, mm -hmm. and what you hear is ba ba, and that's actually the true sound mm -hmm. that's being played. But what he's saying when you you read his lips is mm -hmm. actually ga ga, mm -hmm. and so this is actually a little trick where they've put one sound mm -hmm. over what he was actually saying to uh, make it look like he was saying something else, but essentially your brain is combining the information of what you hear and what you see, huh. just like what you were saying, to form a complete representation of what's being spoken. And so it was really interesting that sometimes uh, your vision could uh, change the uh -huh. perception of what you heard. Uh -huh. And what's really interesting about this is that some people may have more dominant vision or more dominant hearing, uh -huh. that one sense may be dominating over the other. Uh -huh. Can you think of an example where that might be? taking place? Um, where one dominates over the other? Mm -hmm. Well, I know that a lot of a lot of people, the way that they learn, like, it's easier for me, for example, to learn words by looking at them mm -hmm. versus learning words by hearing them. So, like, when you're learning a new language, for example, you have to change how 
how you teach someone a new language or how you learn someone or learn a new language depending on how you whether you think you're a visual learner or an, um, an auditory learner. Yeah, that's a good example. How about also maybe if someone uh, had an accident or if mm -hmm. they were deaf, mm -hmm. let's say, and they couldn't hear at all, mm -hmm. then those people would probably be very highly visual. Mm -hmm. And actually those people uh, become very good at reading lips. Mm -hmm. And so by practicing reading lips, mm -hmm. probably their visual input is dominating over mm -hmm. what they could hear, maybe if they had some a little bit of residual hearing left. Mm -hmm. um, and on the other side, maybe if there's a blind person, mm -hmm. they become very good at, uh, at hearing. Mm -hmm. um, another more practical example might be if you're at a party, right, mm -hmm. and you're in a room that's very noisy, mm -hmm. uh, you know, if you're trying to talk to someone who's right next to you, mm -hmm. you might not be able to actually hear very well what mm -hmm. they're saying. Mm -hmm. But So what do you do in that situation to understand what they're saying? Well, you can try and understand from their movements or mm -hmm. their gestures whether or not they're, you know, they're excited about something, so then you figure out the appropriate response if mm -hmm. you really can. Or then you can try and read their lips. That's right. So a lot of times people will also stare mm -hmm. at your lips when you talk in mm -hmm. a loud environment because mm -hmm. that will, uh, just like in this example, mm -hmm. it will help give you more information to form a complete representation of what someone is saying. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it was really interesting because even though um, he's, what I'm hearing is ba-ba and what he's saying is ga-ga, mm -hmm. um, when, when I integrate both the hearing and then the visual cues, um, it sounds like a very strange da da. So mm -hmm. it's like my brain doesn't really know um, what so to maybe, do with that information. Yeah, maybe your brain is on to the fact that there's something tricky going yeah, on. Yeah, and is so it, it just sounds this would like, not seems normally, like a really strange right. sound. This would not but normally it's not a ever happen. Sound at all. Yeah, yeah, this would never happen normally. Um, so the 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 um, take home point here is mm -hmm. that what you see influences what you hear. Hmm.